Hey guys, today I'll show you how to install Kodi from scratch. If you wanted to install it via the App Store for Apple or Google Play if you have um, Android, I'm going to do it here through Windows. Uh, after that, we're going to install the wizard to get the custom build, and then we're going to play around a little bit with the submenus. So let's get started. Open up Google, type in Kodi. Kodi.tv. Hit download tab. Go ahead and click install if you're on Windows. If not, just skip this part and just do it for Android or Apple or whichever. Once you've downloaded it, just double click it and install it. So just click next, next. I agree, next. Once it's all finished and install, just go ahead and open it, run it. Once you've done that, you want to go to System because we're going to add the uh, the wizard. So go to System and then go to File Manager. Add the source. Click on Add Source. I'll put the the source in the for the wizard in the description. This is the source. HTTP slash slash wizard dot s r v e dot io slash aw underscore zip that will be in the description just click done just give it a name there and put ours and then click ok so the source is added so just go back click on home go to system click on add-ons install zip file go into your ours that you the source that you just added and click on script. This one here, a zip. Take a minute to install. So once it's installed, it will be in under program. So just go ahead and click on ours wizard. They can click on Browse Builds. We're going to choose. Uh, there's quite there's quite a few builds, but we'll take the best. We'll go with Apollo. We're going to choose Apollo Seven, which is the latest, and it's for Jarvis. I'm going to click Install. I'll pause this video while this downloads. Right, so it's done. Now it's going to ask you to force close Cody. If you're on Android, Apple, just unplug. Windows, you just click OK. Now let's reopen Cody. And here's the Apollo build. That's pretty fast. So now it's going to download whatever update it has to download. There you are. Movies are here. Whatever you want to watch, just click it. It has a ton of movie add-ons. All right. So now, if you want to add submenus, like right here, you gotta go to System. So let's go to System. This is a little different since it's using the Silvo and not Maniac from Aeonox. So just click on Appearance. Under skin, go to settings. Click on click on the setup main menu. These are all the sections. So let's say we want to add. Uh, let's go to movies, and we want to manage the sub menu under movies. These are all the ones that's added right now. That comes with the build. So we're going to click add, change action. We're going to choose change action, and we're going to Use, uh, we're going to add a video add on. So you go on, under add ons, video add ons, and uh, say a BBC iPlayer. So click that, create menu item to here. We want to label it, so we'll call it BBC. Click done. That's it, just escape. 
it will create the sub menu. So let's find it. Movies. And you've added the sub menu right here, BBC. So that's all.